Today is a very simple claw on a servo that's powered by an Arduino, a USB web camera, both connected to this laptop. It's running OpenCV, and this script is going to send commands to the Arduino to open and close the claw while the camera watches and learns the difference between those two positions. Once it's learned, it's going to give keyboard input to the user where a spacebar opens and closes the claw. At the same time, the camera is watching and outputs in this terminal window what position it thinks the claw is in. So we'll go ahead and give it a run. And then you'll see that we do get a video output just so you can see what the uh, algorithm sees. And we'll go ahead and use the spacebar to toggle the position of the claw. And you'll see in the terminal window it says opened and then closed respectfully so it knows the difference between the positions. I'm going to go ahead and put an object in here. This is just uh, one of those memory card reader things, USB. And then once you put it in there and it closes, You'll see that it says 85.81% closed. It actually reads the percentage closed that the claw is when it knows that it hasn't closed all the way. And you can see that there's still functionality open and closed like normal. This is a, a battery from a cell phone. I'll put that in there. We'll see what we get. 83%, so that's just only 2% less than that reader. And then... Um, Got a breadboard, very typical style. 82% close. It's only 1%. Now, the interesting thing, if you look at these actual outputs of the three objects that I put inside the claw themselves, um, it went from the memory card reader at 85.8% to the battery Samsung 83.6% and to the breadboard at 82.9%. Now I'm going to hold those objects up. I lined them up at the bottom so you can see that they're flat. Now look at the difference in the height of them. See how how minimal, like there's my finger, how minimal this was. That 1 or 2% that the program's reading is actually extremely accurate given the size of these objects which is one of the cool features of this software is to be able to put something in that claw and then actually get accurate measurement data just from the vision alone put it in the breadboard in lengthwise and it says it's 51 percent closed now you'll notice that it doesn't seem like the claw is moving very much to generate that 51 percent but it's a statistical analysis of all the pixels, not just the what you would call the tips of the claws, so to say. It, it's it's the whole claw uh, and the pixels that it takes up in the view. So it it'll take a little while for it to understand the distances and the closure rates, but they are proportional to the physical objects. So it might take a little while to just actually figure out what percentage correlate to what distance is. But that's basically all um, that I have right now with, with this script. It's still a work in progress. I'm going to try to universalize this with other arms and other claws just to show how easy it is to adapt to different hardware after the um, actual algorithms themselves and code is done. So hopefully I'll get a video out soon. Thanks for watching.